the Free State Project doesn't do really anything in New Hampshire, asterisk. There are two events that the Free State Project runs, the Porcupine Freedom Festival and the New Hampshire Liberty Forum. And those events um, have, a, have a variety of purposes, but one of them is to um, showcase, kind of showcase what New Hampshire is all about for prospective participants. So people from all around the country come to those events, in the case of Pork Fest, about 15, somewhere in the 1,500 to 2,000 uh, attendance range. People come and just see what we're doing here. And Liberty Forum typically draws or 500 maybe, um, and they have uh, speakers from all over the country. So those are things the Free State Project does. But in addition to that, Free Staters do all kinds of events, uh, big ones, little ones, etc. cetera. Um, businesses, many Free Staters have moved businesses to New Hampshire. Many Free Staters have started businesses in New Hampshire. It would be impossible to overview all of those, but the list is long and deep. Restaurants, food products, breweries, farms, Bitcoin and blockchain related businesses, real estate, several real estate businesses, transportation, collections, arbitration, silver, smithing, and a variety of things like that. Um, business development, construction, publishing, blah, 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 blah. So there's a whole bunch of business people here in New Hampshire. Um, it's exhausting just to even think about it all. And then in the non for profit sector, there's charities and co ops. And uh, so many free staters are donors, contrary to maybe uh, what some people would like to cast libertarians as sort of greedy, uh, selfish, only self-interested people. Um, a charity is actually a, a, a cornerstone of many free staters' way of thinking. 